I think because her training allows one to feel so at ease with their voice and their technique, she's really helped me to be able to forge a path in my vocal category and I'm so grateful for this type of training because in a way it's natural, as natural as we speak. So I find that ability to sing in a natural way um, so freeing and, and uh, she's, she's really helped me to stay vocally healthy uh, in a very difficult career over the last 22 years. We started in 1991. Well, she talks about operitis, which is kind of that over-opening that we see a lot of singers engaging in, and how to avoid it, how to be able to engage in a strong breath, which has lots of breath energy, but without a lot of tension. And there's muscular involvement, but in the right way. Air is what gives you the most feeling of support, not muscle. With only muscle, then you feel tight, you've got to feel the air. See, and you, it's too late to feel it after you breathe. You've got to feel it before you inhale. No, you're still thinking sound, and then this, the soft palate can't lift on its own. She knew um, how my, my technique was getting off track, and she was really so supportive. We just took it lesson by lesson, and I, have been studying closely with her for the last, say, seven to eight months. It's just been so wonderful to feel my youthful voice again. Muscles follow air. Air leads muscles. Better.